August 1962. In an interview with Marilyn Monroe, Miss Magazine gleefully asked her, how does it feel to be a sex symbol? Her response, a sex symbol becomes a thing. I just hate to be a thing. Oh, Marilyn, I know you never asked for your bones. What a shame we made you pay for how your skin stretched over them. Symmetry called it perfect, even you. Stitchless beauty, our own American doll. The way we hung you in the headlights of Hollywood, printed you on eight by tens, made you as common as a cough. At the advent of the color motion picture, you shifted the beauty paradigm, caused brunettes the wrist rip up fistfuls of air, hoping it would bloom back blinds. People migrated towards you as if it was the gold rush. We did not care for Norma Jean. We made us Marilyn Monroe. You became our epidemic, but it was all your fault, sweetheart. The way we scanned your body like an item to be put in a bag told you that what you had to say was about as interesting as a dial tone. You were too pretty to be considered the shy girl. Mistook your quietness for either stuck up or dumb. Ha, you don't need a brain, baby, with a body like that. Is what they told you. It has been 50 years since your death and you have become what you never wanted to be, an emblem, an icon, a pinup pimp for all things sexy. Your body, nothing but a mound of flesh rotting in a tomb, yet your epithet still howls from the grave, blonde bombshell. Honey, sweetie, baby, a person turns placard. You never asked for your bones and yet you're still strewn across billboards, an imprint on a Visa Platinum, the way we used you like a napkin to wipe ourselves clean with. Your skin was that distracting. We never thought to ask you how you felt in it, simply to open the curtain and announce you sex symbol of the men of your era modestly declared heartthrobs despite all the Joe DiMaggio punches you received from a husband who we deemed hero when the only bit of advice you ever received from producers was this just duck if he ever tries to hit you in the face doll that's just too pretty to bang up we made you a second hand as a receipt a proof of purchase that you are just some thing Girl, no wonder you had trouble sleeping. Afraid if you closed your eyes for too long, women would come in and slit your silhouette in an attempt to stitch themselves in it. Men would ecstatically rape your shadow. You, Marilyn, were that sexy, we couldn't help it. As soon as you cursed, we felt that your body was ours for the taking. Squeezed you like an avocado to see if you were ripe enough. We peeled you like a fruit. We thought you honey to. Apricot, you were supple, sensuous. The thought of being with you muddled men caused women to curse their own skin for the way their bones formed under it. Would you stop crying? Why are you such an ungrateful bitch? Don't you know people would kill to be you, Marilyn? Because who would have ever thought you would kill yourself to not? <laughs>